time. I don't really know what the um, security system is going to be like here. But it's really great to see these many people out here for Jeremy Hammond. And he does have um, a court date tomorrow at 4 p.m. Are you silly? And I'm, I'm good too. I'm good. Okay. I'm okay. Yeah, he does have a court date, um, a court appearance at 4, it's, um, and there's a, at 3.30, there's kind of a, a solidarity rally planned for before that, so he's going to be in court tomorrow, and this is just a bunch of people out here to show their support for Jeremy, and there's a lot of people in there watching. So they know that you know they they can hear this. They know that they're that they're not alone. That there are people out here thinking about them, which is really important. And if you go to freehamens.org or freeanons.org, um, you can learn a lot more about. It. There's also a really good mail to jail.org website. Has addresses for a lot of political prisoners, um, including Jeremy Hammond, that you can write to them if you want to do that. Really great. <laughs> 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 yes. Uh, I'm on Bamboozer. Yeah, but a small underscore there, yeah. Yeah, so it's not looking so hard, it's like doing it too. And this is really fun. <laughs> That's in the end. <laughs> and yeah, so this is just jail support. Um, uh, there is. Yeah, there's a lot of really wonderful energy out here in New York. And you can look at everybody's watching. Hi up there. watching this great demonstration and I really I know that people are out here and it, it makes me it makes me so happy uh, just to know that uh, trying to take pictures at the same time and I other people taking pictures Yeah, no, the main photograph up was like, yeah. So. other instruments as well. <laughs> so this, this is really exciting to see. for Jeremy Hammond, and um, we're really encouraging people to come out um, to that, to, the, to this location. Um, he's having a court appearance in about 13 months. He's been held in federal custody, so if you meet at Foley Square at 3.30 p.m. tomorrow, that would be like really awesome to just come and talk to courtroom so he sees a lot of smiling faces. Um, when, you know, when, he's in, when he gets to actually see, it, see his family and his friends. Um, his mom is up here, his brother is here. <laughs> and if, um, if you go to freehamming.org, all the time and date and location and stuff are on there if you're watching this and like, you don't remember later.
They would have cared, but I don't even have that job anymore. But I mean, it's like too late to change it. Yeah, someday. <laughs> so we're I'm here. No, I think you've been in there for too long. long. I think you've been in there for too long. Uh, yeah. Well, it's that not even day. like an anonymous okay. issue. It's like it relates to the charges. Like it relates to why he's in there. 
in a way, like just if the government is doing like unrelentlessly violating people's privacy and using companies to collect data, like the software companies that they're, you know, collecting all this information from people. Oh God, they got him behind barbed wire. You get that boy out of there right now. Oh yeah, this is his mom. This is his mother. Right here. Jeremy does not need barbed wire. He gets mad right now. I mean, if you want to. Not that he did. Oh, thank you, Sarah. Thank you so much. I am, um, so I'm outside the Metropolitan Correctional Center. Um, the federal U.S. Marshal, the federal marshal told us, told us that we couldn't demonstrate here before because it was loitering. And then they suggested that everyone get an attorney. And then just filmed us all and, and like, walked away. And then just kind of, um, they, they didn't like actually say you have to leave or anything like that. They kind of got in a discussion, a debate that resulted in I was filming the, them talking to us. Um, so then they, the federal marshal was filming us and people demonstrating. or calling his name, and we moved over, I guess you could call it the side of the building, I've never been over here before, um, and it's done, it's like kind of the side of the building, so we don't really, people who can see out the Do we have to go back to the front where we were? Okay. So we have to go. Oh, okay. So a car. Yes. Yes. She said we could go back where we were because apparently um this this vehicle needs to um park here and people need to um, be able to get out of it. So yeah, she did say we could go back over here where we were. Um. Yeah, have you seen that? Have you seen the game? The Tactivator game? No. Yeah, oh, it's like a, you can project it, and it's a video game. It's, it's really fun. I think that that's what that email was, yeah. Very cool. Excellent. I'm doing three things tomorrow. I know. So we just got told um, by the female, um, I don't want to say officer, but the female um, 